Let's now get you the latest updates from the United Kingdom. Voters across the country will head to the polls to choose their local decision makers on Thursday. These elections will be held for all London borough councils. A number of councils and local authorities in Wales and Scotland. Northern Ireland voters will be taking to their polling stations to elect members of the Northern Ireland Assembly. While these elections will decide the, the, the local level leaders, they will also express voters' opinions on national issues, including the cost of living crisis, the ongoing partygate row and the government's response to the war in Ukraine. And the latest survey polls have predicted disaster for the Conservative Party. The survey conducted on some 1,700 participants in 201 councils that will be going to the polls this week suggested that Labour will hold nearly 3,500 seats this time, a gain of more than 800, while the Tories will retain just under 980, a fall of 548. The polls further suggest that the Tories could lose control of flagship councils. Prime Minister Boris Johnson sat for an interview with Good Morning Britain and acknowledged that the government could not provide enough support to offset the higher costs immediately. I accept that, that those contributions from the taxpayer, because that's what it is, taxpayers' money, isn't going to be enough immediately uh, to, to, uh, to help cover everybody's costs. Of course that isn't going to, to work in, uh, so you enough acknowledge in the you short term. So you're not doing everything there you is, can. There is more that we can do do yes but the crucial thing the crucial thing is to make sure we deal with the prices over the medium and although you're quite right to point out that there is an inflationary risk and it's very severe it could get worse and that knocks on to interest rates and that knocks on to the cost of borrowing for everybody and i'm sorry to to say this but we have to be prudent in our approach. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.